evening and a huge welcome to everybody here in our academy, to our members, to our VIP guests and to all our amazing team awesome. This has been a day that we have worked so so hard for over the last uh, few months and we are super excited to share with you all our new and amazing and improved brand which you can probably, probably see behind me here. So we have rebranded to the Academy Master Plan. And we are live right now, not only on Instagram and on Facebook, but also on RTE1. Yeah. Yeah. So folks, get excited. You're going to be seeing so much more of us over the next few months. Uh, we, as many of you might know, I lost just over four stone myself uh, back in 2008. And since then, I have been on a mission with a master plan to rid the world of obesity. I feel it's something that no person should carry, that you feel so amazing whether you lose half a stone or more, that literally it's a dream and a goal that I want to share with every single person. And we're gonna do it through eating amazing food, we're gonna be the educators in weight loss, and we're gonna teach you how to eat better, not less, and live not only lighter, but healthier, happier, and longer forever. So folks, I'm gonna cook for you today, in the midst of all of this madness and no pressure at all, so I, uh, I'm going to get a pan on. New hob, new kitchen, new design, new everything, so I'm hoping I'll be able to find what I need. So if you have questions and you're tuned in, please uh, ask them as we go, either Facebook or Instagram. Or anybody in here has questions, please feel free to shout away. And uh, so many have already subscribed to our online course, which is relaunching on Monday. So I am super excited to share with you all over the next six weeks on an amazing journey. So we are cooking. Today we have a gorgeous Thai chicken noodle soup. I'm gonna get this on and then I can chat some more to you. So first up, I'm gonna get some garlic. And ginger. Onto the pan. So garlic and ginger, both. Uh, any herbs and spices that you're adding into a dish is gonna add so much goodness. The earliest form of medicine was all our herbs and spices, so 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 important to get good nutrition into the body. So just give that a couple of minutes to cook. You'll know literally once you start to sense or smell. That's all we need next actually on these videos is the sense of smell. But once you start to smell the aromas coming off, you know you're good to go. So we get this another sec. Uh, a little bit. You can see plenty of colour as well here in front of me. What we try to do is take every single dish that you might like to cook and add in lots more nutrients, more goodness. And a lot of your veg and all those colors of the rainbow are actually the things that have the fewest calories for actually the most nutrition. It's gonna heal and cure the inside of the body and actually make you look and feel amazing then as well. So a little bit of red onion going in. And if as I said to all the time in all of our recipes, if there are things that we cook with, there are ingredients that you're thinking, oh no way, I don't actually like that, then feel free to swap them out. Uh, and it is a journey of discovering new tastes as well. I find 10 years ago when I first lost weight, my diet and what I ate is probably very different actually to what I eat today. So uh, I would encourage you to try something new. Even with my seven year old, we get him to try a new veg or new fruit every single month. And that's his only challenge is that in that whole month, he has to find something new to have. Uh, and he enjoys it actually now. And he looks forward rather than actually putting something on his plate and then dreading the thoughts of eating it. So. So in case you're worried guys that whenever you sign up that you're going to be eating absolutely nothing or dust as they say, uh, I promise you that will not be the case. Some of our recipes include Thai curries, taco chips even, nachos, chicken and black beans, chicken pies, the filo pastry. Uh, we even have a new vegetarian seven day plan as well. So literally cater for all tastes. So we get some more of our veg in here then some gorgeous carrots going in some red pepper and some mulch too. So if any questions please do shout. Uh, you can subscribe, we have a new YouTube channel as well. It is Master of Weight Loss, exactly as my Instagram name actually because we're going to share so much of what we do here and uh, an awful lot of the joy of being here in the academy is meeting the amazing members on a weekly basis that come through the doors that literally they are changing their lives and it's the most inspirational thing ever. 
So on YouTube, we're going to bring more of that to you, let you meet these people, let you chat and interact with them, along with the likes of our cookery demos, our advice and our tips. Um, but so much more then to when you actually subscribe, you will get full access to our app, and we can now stream live into that app as well. So you will see these cookery demos as done right here in front of you, and uh, you will also then get access to live workouts from myself and Frank. Uh, lots of uh, information from our team and what goes on here behind the scenes throughout the week. So it really is a really exciting time in all things at Calvary Life. Question coming through here for you, Karen. Yeah. Carrie, LOL. Does your plan cater for vegetarians? Yes, just uh, we've been literally for 2019. Because I am a meat eater, uh, I do focus obviously on a lot of less uh, vegetarian recipes. But 2019, we have a new seven day vegetarian plan as well. And in the room, I always call her a resident vegetarian. Deborah's here with us today as a member. Deborah lost over five stone in seven, eight months, wasn't it? But seven or eight months, I'm completely vegetarian. So hope for all you vegetarians out there who are wondering, will you still be able to get enough protein into the body? And I think for a lot of vegetarians, they actually tend to cut out meat but don't replace it with anything else and literally eat a very high carb diet. Uh, so we would encourage you to try other proteins as well to make sure you're getting enough protein into the body. Okay, for another one. Yeah. Other weight loss plans don't really push activity. Do you think it's important to have activity to lose weight? Yeah. Uh, well, two answers to actually that question. My own personal journey, I lost over four stone in about eight months, doing absolutely zero activity whatsoever, and was quite happy to never have to walk or run a mountain again from my early childhood playing camogie and football. And then I started my master's in weight management at the University of Chester. And the first lecture was on heart health. And the guy who I said to me, Karen, you are fit and healthy, or you're healthy, you're healthy weight, but you're gonna drop dead of a heart attack someday if you don't become more active. And I literally, it was like a light bulb moment. I left going, oh my God, I need to become more active. So overnight, and I come home and I reflected as well as a young woman thinking, why do I actually not want to use these days that I have? So I decided literally from that day forward that, and I think as people do get older as well, it's so, so important to be mobile and nearly like use it or lose it to actually be as active as you possibly can. So now as part of all of our plans, we encourage people to be active for around 150 minutes per week as a minimum, literally for your heart, not to get you losing any extra weight, literally for your head or mental health, for your heart, for toning, for the body, for all the good reasons that you should be active. But not to scare anybody either, if you're sitting at home and you're thinking, well, I'm not active at all, I don't really want to get started. You will do so much weight loss wise, getting the food right first, and then build that up slowly. Literally take 10 or 20 minutes this week, get out for a walk, we're blessed here, and you decide beaches and mountains as well, and nothing better for the head than getting either. Hope that helps. And Vicky wants to know, do you weigh in at home on your own scales? question. You, anybody who does the online course, people who come physically to the academy get weighed in here obviously. Anybody who logs online has two options. They can use any scales at all and manually log, weigh themselves and then manually log their weight into our app. Uh, people can also purchase scales directly from us as well with Sync Automatically, uh, which LMD uses, we'll talk in a minute, uh, but Sync Automatically and it Bluetooths that into the app for you and it comes directly to me then as well. Um, and some people find that just maybe a, more of a direct way, so you can't cheat really in that sense if it's coming directly from the scale then straight to me. Uh, some days you might feel like sitting at home and you're weighing yourself, you might have gained four pounds and you might only log in that you gained one or straight the same. So. Okay. Another one here, Smoby37. Is it too late to register for the online course? Also, is the LMD discount code applicable? Ooh, there you go. Minute. starts on Monday but after that you literally sign up any day and once you sign up you literally start from the next day so you can sign up continuously now throughout 2019 and beyond and LMD's discount code is LMD2019 which is still active then today. So I'm just going to check to make sure I'm out in what I'm supposed to be doing. Uh, but it's hi Tori Pace for too busy talking. So any uh, brand of Thai curry paste really that you like, uh, you could make your own completely from scratch. But I'm always conscious as well, very often when people sign up to the if you're coming from a place of eating maybe particularly curry, maybe there's more takeaways and all in there. So you want to go for options 
that aren't going to have you sitting in the kitchen at home cooking for maybe an hour or two on end. You want meals that are really simple that you can cook literally in 10 or 20 minutes. Karen, question on Facebook from Lauren. She's getting married next year and wants to know what advice you have so she feel amazing on her wedding day. Sign up today. How are you yeah. lost your plan? <laughs> right now, let's get started on Monday. Uh, yeah, but a wedding, I think, is such an amazing day, obviously, in anybody's life, particularly any woman's life. Uh, and I always think of that show, um, Say Yes to the Dress. And I know they often say that when even like everybody will look good on their wedding day and you get dressed up, you make that effort, extra effort, and you will look good in your wedding dress. But what you really want is to feel amazing, and I think that's the difference probably for most people. And deep, deep down, you know yourself, and for everybody's journey is so different, but you know whether it's half a stone or more that you want to lose to feel that bit more amazing. So I definitely just get started. What I say to people, even when they haven't signed up, people always tell me they have absolutely no idea to lose weight. Not a clue. And then I say to them, if I told you that I'd give you 10 grand if you had a stone off you in the next six weeks. Many people in this room even would lose a stone in six weeks. Yeah. <laughs> Not a bother, but why? Because we see it as it's an instant motivator. It's like, right, 10 grand, now I know what to do. You wouldn't even have to ask me what you should be having for breakfast, lunch, or dinner. You would just be actually out there and doing it. So nearly use that to think, gosh, what habits do I have? Do I think it's the takeaways? Do I think it's getting up, not getting up early enough in the morning to breakfast? Is it not taking my lunch to work with me every day and I run out the doors and I have to pick something in a deli and I don't opt for a good choice? Is it coming in late in the evenings like I used to do and I need 10 Kit Kats in the fridge while I'm standing thinking about what I should actually cook for the dinner. Whereas now I'll make sure that I cook, or at least even know what I'm going to cook or have a thought about what I'm going to have for dinner that night. So I hope you will feel amazing on your wedding day and you're going to sign up and we will help get you there. Uh, a bit of chicken stock just going in. Conscious I'm trying to keep you. If you're following the recipe along, all we've done so far is we put in the garlic and the ginger, fried all that off, added in some veg, the Thai curry paste, so super simple, and we have put the chicken stock in. If you wanted this vegetarian, you can almost stop at that point uh, and not put in the chicken, or feel free even to add prawns or any protein really that you prefer. So I'm gonna let this simmer for a sec. And I'm gonna get so simple. I have some chicken that I cooked earlier, but if you were doing this as well, if I was doing this at home, I would have this pan on, and I would have another pan boiling with chicken or vegetable stock, and just have two or three or four, even chicken fillets boiling away at the same time. So it means then when it comes to the soup being really done, I just slice up the chicken fillets and throw them in. And it's probably the most cost effective way to do it as well. Loads of people saying the place looks well. Ah, oh, thank you. Frank said we've seen another piece of copper coming through the doors from online shopping that I think he was going to be out the door. So uh, I think I've enough copper probably in the kitchen now. But delighted actually to finally be using it. I'm excited for all the online content and all that we will be able to put out. Uh, these are the little packs of rice noodles actually that I'm losing, using today. These are gluten free as well, so a lot of people like them for that reason. But again, you can have any noodle, just add a bit of bulk to it. Oh, a little bit of stock in there and then we're just going to let this simmer and then it's going to be good to go and just add a bit of coriander more fresh herbs at the end adding any fresh herbs a handful of fresh herbs to any dish increases the antioxidants in it by about 65 percent so if you have overindulged in anything food alcohol takeaways whatever it might be the more antioxidants you're you're mantling the inside of your body you have about 50 trillion cells that you need to feed and most days we're throwing things in that actually are killing half of them rather than actually feeding them. So the more antioxidants and the more goodness, depending on how much of the other stuff you're putting in, the more you can get in, the better. So I'm going to let this simmer. I'm going to get Alan D you come up and uh, have a wee chat with us. So.
So I kind of stalked her for a while after that and sent her wee subliminal like messages, messages just to say if you ever want to chat or if you ever need help, I'm here, or, you know. And then you contacted me probably back in March. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And how are you feeling? I suppose when we first met, even or? Well, I suppose I contacted Karen because you were in my head, um, and I tried so many different things to. I just find whenever I'm so busy with work, I'm grabbing the most convenient foods or easy foods that are just quick and convenient. But whenever it came to car, I knew there was going to be a wee bit more work involved. And I wasn't ready for that just yet. So whenever I got my head around it and thought, right, it's time to do this now because I wasn't feeling confident on my, in myself, especially whenever I'm all over social media and that's the main place that my, my business grows from. I need it given a face. Yeah, a little push basically. So I contacted you, you came down and see me. I think the fact that I came down and we met really kick started it all together. Um, plus I heard about there were skills that digi digitally mm -hmm. Bluetooth, Bluetooth. Yeah, yeah. and they're my favourite part of the whole thing. That means that I can just jump on and it was a female there's female lots of sugar and female minus. Yeah. Unreal. So we've been yeah. doing good so far. So I'm happy, I'm just, I'm just not where I want to be just yet, but I'm getting there, I will get there, so. And how do you stay focused and motivated? So everybody know any of the designers on social media will know how busy you are, uh, and that's a lot of people's really reason or excuse maybe for not succeeding at anything is our yeah, busy life. Busy. Well, to be honest, that was an excuse, there was no reason. I was using that as an excuse, mm -hmm. um, but realistically, I'm the same as every same hours of the day as Beyonce, so, you know, I don't um, see it me any different than her, you know? Um, <laughs> Hashtag Beyonce in her quicker. But no, I just find it, I feel so much better now, because at least I know what to do. Like, for example, you know, I can make things like this for this before I never dreamed that, and not that I never dreamed, but I just was like, get somebody to make it for me. Whereas now I know it's not half as hard to do it, and it doesn't take half as long. So. As a young woman, I think, like, a young girl said to me all the time, you so many messages on Instagram, in particular the last few weeks from our course launched, and people are saying, oh, but I don't cook, and I don't like to cook, and I don't want to cook, and, you know, and I think, like, we all allow time in our day to do whatever the priorities are, so if it is, as a lot of young women it is, to get up and put your makeup on first thing in the morning, most of us are going to do that before we even think about breakfast, mm -hmm. so, and yet, which is more important for us in the long term, to have a, a body that's going to, my life thought I say all the time, it's lived to 117, mm -hmm. if I'm going to get anywhere near that, I need to put... <laughs> Pretty damn good food in here, whereas most of us think, oh sure, you know, I'll eat whatever the hell I like and she would see what happens. But in this country, actually, most of us, um, if our average lifespan should be around 90. Most people, men aren't getting to 70, and most women aren't getting to 80, which is frightening, yeah. you know. And a lot of that is not, because there's been so many medical advances, most of that is actually because of what we're eating and drinking and how we're actually living. So you need a bit of balance in your life. So my priorities then are that, you know what, I'm going to try and put as amazing food as I possibly can in most of the time. And because I have two young kids then as well, I feel it's actually joyous then to go home and to cook for them, and to cook a gorgeous dinner or breakfast or lunch or whatever it is. I feel that for them, it's so hard for kids nowadays. Like I know when I was growing up, there wasn't half the stuff that there is now. And uh, so imagine if they need some good food then at home. Deborah just wants to ask a question here. Did you say their skills can be purchased with this plan? Yes, and they're out of stock there. We'll back up on the website. Uh, back on the website from tomorrow and that is the academymasterplan.com so all the website facebook page is all changing to the academy master plan from after this session yeah i'm going to keep cooking and um, you know anything you know well, you're pretty good now in the kitchen as you are uh so i'm sure you check out i believe is your absolute favorite yeah everybody loves it around family so we're doing it <laughs> just everybody that's following us that actually cooks that one and I'm forgetting what I'm actually doing here as well. Louise, you look amazing. This is all coming through here now. Okay. That's not just me saying that. Nobody said it's all going to be There's the older ones. And that's the funniest comment I got. Do you know on Instagram you ask people, ask me anything? And they ask me anything. And then I got one that said, um, what foundation do you recommend for the older lady? Twenty-one though, so I was like Peter Pan and I'll live forever, so I really don't mind. 
uh, and it's only a number, but it's about how you feel and enjoy and the best years of your life. And I think for Louise, it's saying we met. Uh, my only regret I lost weight when I was about 30, 31. And had I done it from that 20 to 30 period, which is such a, a critical early period in your life, and such an important period in most people's life growing up, and you know, I think that's one wish I would have for all young girls that they can do it at that age and have healthy eating habits and actually have them for life, you know. And that's what I suppose for our brand going forward as well. I would love people to think that, because people are such a fear of chicken mommies maybe of young girls and all too, that I don't want to send them to a weight loss club or, but yet why not teach young girls and young boys how to have healthy eating habits forever? And that's what it's about. Scales are only a measure of that. Um, I have no fear at all of putting our two boys on scales. Anytime they pop up here, they'll hop on them. Just like they would if they were the doctor or doing anything else. And they'll say, mommy, I'm still healthy and I'll say yes. Mm -hmm. So it's never about the numbers, it's actually about healthy habits forever. So back to cooking. Another question, Janet in Belfast, what happens after the six weeks expire? Good question. So online we have kept the format that you sign up for six weeks. Because for a couple of reasons, I believe it's a good period of time to feel committed to something without feeling uncommitted for life as such, to give it a go, to see what you think. Um, but also I say in that time people should be able to use a stone in six weeks as well. So very achievable and very manageable for a lot of people in that time. Conscious too though that so many people would like to lose more than that. So literally the minute your six weeks is up or before it, we will bombard you. We'll keep you on. Uh, but hopefully you've enjoyed it all anyway up to that point and you're dying to sign up again. Uh, we then have a monthly subscription which online is 25 euros per month then online to stay on with us. Uh, and if you're really lucky some points in the year we do. Discount codes and offers and all that as well. So. Particularly if you subscribe to our YouTube channel, you might find out all about those first. So, soup is nearly done, folks. I'm going to put in a little bit of fresh coriander. I'm not sure if one of our cameras want to get a bit closer, or might actually pour it out in the bowl, maybe. I will. So, I have the bowl, stop here. Easy and quick and simple. What's that? Bowl full of goodness. It looks delicious. Somebody said that. Smells lovely. Smell it in and come in. We'll work on that one. If I could pour a bit neater. <laughs> this is where you need the food stylist coming in behind it, actually. Work with the noodles and watch the splashes. So, Thank you so much for watching.